Hi, welcome to the CDOC's tip of the day. Today I want to talk about a very important aspect of CEREC restorations, which is the thickness of the restoration. Each manufacturer has a very specific recommendation for how thick to make their material. And if you don't follow those recommendations, you're going to have problems. You're going to have restorations that break prematurely. Now, the way we check the thickness of our restoration is under analyzing tools. You turn on your analyzing tools and turn on cursor details. Now, I always just leave this on. This always stays on. I never have it off. I realize it's a little large and maybe sometimes a little intrusive and in the way, but very quickly I can tell whether that restoration is thick enough. We wanna look at the fissure thickness and the fissure thickness for most materials is 1.5 millimeters. For Emax and Zirconia, you can be as thin as a millimeter. And then the, our high strength zirconia, our 3Y zirconia, our Cirex zirconia, you can go as thick as 0.6 millimeters. But Katana and Emax, one millimeter, everything else, try to get a millimeter and a half. And if you have that, you're gonna have a good chance of a long lasting restoration. If you violate that, chances are you're gonna be struggling with fractures and you have no one to blame but yourself. So make sure that cursor details is always turned on and we'll see you next time on the tip of the day.